Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Well, hey everyone, Bill with Fishing with Odad, and oh man, I see another place. Oh wow. Oh man, this this part of Tennessee is just loaded with places to fish. Anyway, let's get back to what we're doing. <clears throat> we are going to hike down the hill here, past these corrals, past all these cows. Hopefully they'll leave me alone. And down in the bottom down there is a pond, a pretty good size one. Uh, yeah, and it's supposed to be loaded with some big old fish. So uh, there's cats, bluegill, crappie, and a few bass. Uh, so we're going to target the panfish today. So uh, hopefully we can get around these little moo-moos right here. Yeah, we'll get around these and get out, get through the gate safely. So yeah, so why don't we quit yakking, get cracking, and get the fishing. Yeah, I don't. I just don't know what rods to bring. So I brought, I brought a couple of panfish rods and a heavier rod that I'm gonna put maybe some night crawlers on and see what happens. Uh, yeah, I just love fishing with moo moos. They're such a pain in the patooty. Yeah. Maybe follow this cow trail down. Of course, I can't quite go underneath that tree. I see the dam. Oh, that looks like a wild rose. Wow. Oh, there's a heron. Looks good. Looks good. Right here. I got a, a rod stand. Yeah. Clear water. I can get to the water. Yeah. I like it. I like it a lot. Place to set my tackle bag. Yeah, so there it is. Look at the trees over there. Isn't that beautiful? They're starting to turn for fall here. Uh huh. Yeah. Can't beat this with a stick. Yeah, this is what I was afraid of. Shoo, shoo, shoo. I'm not here to feed you. Let's try our beloved curly tail. Yeah. House beetle spins darker. Darker, same size blade, but a little bigger and darker. So it might be the ticket in here at the muddy water instead of that white one. Oh, what do I got? Do I have one? I got one, guys. I got a fish. I got a fish. Whoa. Whoa. I don't know what it is. Decent size, though. Decent size. Crappie? What do I got? What do I got? Oh, it's a nice, it is a nice crappie. Oh, I can't get to it. Oh, it's stuck here in the branches. Ah.
That was a bad thing to do. That was a bad thing to do. Oh, nice crappie. Okay, he's out. He's out. He's out. Sort of out. Come on. Come on, buddy. Yeah, I'll help you any way I can, but you're going to have to help me. Nice crappie. Nice, nice crappie. Yeah. Oh, barely hooked. Barely, barely hooked now. Uh. Oh, I think we might be able to get him. I think we might be able to get him. Got him. Got him, got him, got him. Now if I can get out of here without falling in the water. Oh, yeah. Okay, we'll deal with that. Oh man, just barely hooked. Oh, nice crappie. Nice, nice crappie. Ah, oh, this one almost looks like a white. This almost looks like a white crappie. And if it is, which I think it is, this would be the first one I think I've ever caught. Yes, beautiful fish. Beautiful. All right, guy. We'll let you go. Oh, man, thanks for being on the show. Yeah. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Well, that was cool. Uh, he just stopped that dead in its tracks. I thought I was snagged. Oh, had another one. Ah, had a hit, had a hit. I'm getting I'm getting lots of hits here, but no hookups again. All right, we're gonna re-rig one of the rods up for a worm on a bobber. Okay, guys, we're rigged up with a float, a worm. I got another one, guys. Thought I was snagged. Another white crappie. Another white crappie. Not as big as the first one. But nice. And that's a white. And that's a white crappie. Yeah. Somewhere in here I have a tape measure. Uh, I wish I would have thought enough to measure the other one. Eleven inches. Eleven inches, guys. Eleven inches. All right, we'll let you go. Thanks for being on the shoe. On the beetle spin, guys. On the beetle spin. Yeah. Oh, I got a bite on the bobber. 
I got a bite on the bobber, guys. Got a bite on the bobber. Okay, got one. Oh, a little bluegill. All right. Little bluegill, guys. Oh, wait a minute. This is a red ear. Oh. This is not a bluegill, guys. This. This is a red ear, a little one. Oh, and he'll get to be big. Yeah, shellcrackers get big, big, big. All right, thanks for being on the shoe, little fella. Got it. A little bluegill this time. Yeah, little bluegill. That's three species. Three species today. Yeah, a little bluegill. Oh, got one. Got one. What do I got this time? Uh, bluegill. A uh, bluegill. Gotta be a mama out there and a papa that are big. Another bite. Got one. Oh, this one seems a little bigger. This one seems a little bigger. Yeah. Yes, it is. Yeah. Yeah. A bigger red ear. Yeah. Oh, we got two of each, two of three species. Two crappie, white crappie, two red ears, two bluegill. Oh, got another one. What do I got this time? This is a bluegill. It's my biggest bluegill. Yeah. Yeah, my biggest one. Hey, for let me show you something, guys. A little helpful hint. If you guys are out and you fish like I do and you got to wear muck boots, take a look at this. Take a look at that. If you're wearing muck boots, these are concrete boots, my old concrete boots from my construction days. What I do... <laughs> To hold my rod, I just stick it in that boot. And if you're out wading in some shallow water, then your 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 reel and your rod isn't getting wet, and you, your hands are free. Isn't that the coolest thing since sliced bread? Okay, got another one. Oh, 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 oh!
broke me off. Okay, got one. You get a fish on that side. What do I got now? Another red ear. Boy, it's been a long time. It's, I don't know if I've ever caught so many red ear at once. No. That's four, I think. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my. What do I got? A cat? Oh, where's he taking me? I can't get him under control. Oh, boy. Oh, he's got me in a mess. He's got, I see it right there, but I've got a lot of junk between me and it. Like this big old tree right here. Maybe he'll get me off of there. I don't think so. Uh, there's no way to get to it. Too much water. But he is running to beat the band. Wow. Oh, that dang branch. There's no way I can get to it. It's too far out in the water. Uh, there's just no way to get to it. Maybe he's tired out and I can get him off of this. There's just no way I can get back. i like to at least see what it is. There he goes. Oh. Man, I can't believe he hasn't broken me off rubbing on this branch. Uh, it's a cat. Uh, it looks like a, it's a channel. Uh, a decent sized one. Oh, I got it. I got him out. Yay. 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 Oh, it's a nice one. Oh, man. Wow. I can't believe I got it out. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Wow. Got it out. Oh, wow. Man, what a day of fishing. Look at this, guys. What a day of fishing. I can't believe the fight it took to get this guy. Oh, thank you, Lord, for allowing me to get it out of there without breaking off. Wow. 
Incredible. Absolutely incredible. Yes. Yes. He's got, he's all of four pounds. Yeah. Oh, oh no. Another nice one. Another nice one. Oh, another cat. Another cat. You ain't going over there. You ain't going over there. That's for sure. Not as big as the other one, but very respectable. Yeah, very respectable. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like he swallowed that one. Well, we're going to have to cut the line. Okay, buddy, we're going to let you go. We're going to let you go. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. There we go, guys. Yeah, another nice kitty. About half the size of the other one. But loads of fun, that's for sure. Okay, got something. There's a little more respectable bluegill here. Yeah. It is, it is. Where is it a red ear? Can't tell yet. Red ear. That's five. I've never caught so many red ear. Well, guys, we're going to call it. Man, what a fishing hole. What a fishing hole. I, don't know. I just don't know how to put it. So I'll just tell you, I guess, what I caught. First off, using the beetle spin, I caught it probably, I didn't measure it, but I would say it's probably it was a 17 inch uh, white, white crappie. White. And I've never caught a white crappie before, ever. They've all been black crappie. Uh, so that was a first. And the second one was another white crappie on the beetle spin. And it, I measured it and it was 11. The other one dwarfed it. So anyway, <clears throat> then I thought, uh, not getting any more bites. I had a bunch of hits, but nothing grabbing the beetle spin. So I switched to a worm and a bobber and I started catching little bluegill uh, basically at my feet and some red ear. Then I went down uh, the other end of the pond, threw in between some stick ups, and just getting scads of red ear and bluegill. Then, big old channel cat, good four pounder, hit it. Didn't think I'd ever get it in, but I managed to. Wait till you see the footage. Then I caught another nice channel, probably pound and a quarter, pound and a half. A uh, bunch more red ear and bluegill. Uh, then I decided I'll see if I can get back on the crappie. And I put a Bobby Garland on, tried the uh, beetle spin, nothing. Put a Bobby Garland on, got a couple of hits, but that's it. So, uh, yeah, it's time to get something to eat and head home. 
and think about the day here. Man, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was awesome fishing here. So anyway, guys, as always, we'll see you next time out here on the water. May not be here, but it's going to be on the water. See you guys. Have fun. Go fishing. Okay, guys. Finally ready. All right. We got a pink Mo Glow Bobby Garland baby shad under a float at about 30 inches. So let's see what happens. I had one one more hit on the on the. Uh, Yeah, I had one more hit on the beetle spin. Boy, I couldn't come up with that. <laughs>